Today's topic of discussion is sulfuramine B assay. Sulfuramine B assay (SRB). SRB is a bright pink aminosanthine dye with two sulfonic groups that bind to basic amino acid residues of cellular proteins under mild acidic conditions and dissociate under basic conditions. As the binding of SRB is psychometric, the amount of dye extracted from stain cell is directly proportional to the cell mass. So the SRB assay is based on binding of the dye to basic amino acids of cellular proteins and colorimetric evaluation provides an estimate of total protein mass, which is related to cell number. This protocol is taken from uh, Istvan, published in Biopro, the journal, uh, the reference is me mentioned here. Uh, it is prepared by first the part is washing off cells with the phosphate buffer solution, then removal of the phosphate buffer solutions, then the addition of trypsin and incubating it at 37 degrees Celsius for a day, and then treating it with the fetal bovin serum, uh, FPS, uh, to inactivate the trypsin. Then the concentration is determined by the hemocytometer for which trypsin tripan blue solution is added and if the cells are intact then the cell will not be, will, will not be stained um, and from that we can check the uh, healthy and unhealthy cells and if it is healthy then we can use those cells for the cytotoxicity activity and before that we have to adjust the cell concentration so preparation of cells for the study is one part then preparation of the uh, the drug or the test solution of the different uh, concentration, a serial dilution we have to prepare. That is the second step. In the third step, we have to mix the treatment drug with the cells. So for this 96 well plate is taken and the uh, compound is added into uh, the, each well as per the concentration and then the cells are uh, seeded there and it is incubated at 37 degrees celsius in a humidified incubator with 5% co2 uh, we have to keep it properly and the cell will attach to the uh, well and for mo most of the cell lines this requires two to three hours then add tca trichloroacetic acid and incubate at 4 degrees Celsius for one hour for the attachment of cells. Then wash with water three to four times. Uh, it should not, the water should not be put forcefully in the well, otherwise it will cause the detachment of cell. And then SRB is added, keep it for 30 minutes and wash with 1% of acetic acid to remove the excess SRB, which is unbound. Once it is removed, we'll be adding trees based solution. The pH is 10.5. So the bound SRB to the protein, it will be removed. It will be solubilized in this trees based solution. And then we can subject it for the analysis, absorbance. And this is a reference from which this protocol is taken. Then percent cell growth is determined by absorbance of sample divided by absorbance negative control or untreated into 100 and percent growth inhibition is equal to 100 minus percent cell growth. From this, we can determine the cytotoxicity of the compounds. So SRB is depend upon the attachment of SRB to protein due to the presence of uh, sulfonic group and then treating, then removing this SRB with the trees based solution and whatever the SRB is removed is directly proportional to the presence of cell. Thank you.